Okay, round three, starting up again. So right now we have, um, this is the display, and we're on the Amazon store. I'm gonna run two different searches for you guys, kinda show you exactly what the ASIN list can do. Um, it can do three different things, actually multiple different things. You can search keywords, you can search brands, you can search um, anything you wanna search in Amazon. You can you can then scrape that store or that listing or those listings um, relatively easy. So let's say I wanna type in Linksys right here, we're already on Linksys. I'm gonna go to this little third little icon right here, go to my top list and go to grab all ASINs. This, all this ASIN is gonna do, it's gonna create a new group. Here it is. It's gonna run through it, it's gonna create a group, and then you what you wanna do on this listing once it's done, you're just gonna hit get best all deals, and then it's gonna search through all these listings very quickly and efficiently. Um, that's a great way to do it. You can also go into um, a keyword, let's say you wanna do router. So you wanna do router, you wanna check router, whatever keyword that you want to use. Um, you go here, you go to top list, you go to down here, you go grab all ASINs. This ASIN is gonna grab 20 pages of all the ASINs on this list, on this page you have. It's gonna grab all these listings. Um, and then again, it's gonna create another group and then you're just gonna run a job list on that. So there's three ways to do it. And then the last way, which we talked about before, is going into somebody's store. Let's go here. Um, we can't do Amazon, but let's say we wanna do new used. We want to find somebody's store, we want to scrape. Let's go. GP Thunder, GP Thunder, you're about to get scraped. Um, we're gonna go here, GP Thunder storefront, and then we're gonna go to the LaCroix extension, top list, again, grab all ASINs. It's then gonna, let's just click on it, grab ASINs. It's then gonna start collecting all these ASINs, number of ASINs, you can see it's starting to run. This run is going to, oops. Um, this is gonna start running and it's gonna stop once it's done, or it's gonna go to 20 pages, so however many things it is. So if it's on a person's store, it's gonna go to 20 pages, that's just 327 or more of these listings. It's going to then catalog them and then upload them pretty quickly, actually, which is pretty sweet. It moves them a lot faster. Oh, again, it still might take a little bit. Again, it's uploading, so just take the time. Take the time. Let me. So once that is uploaded, it's going to jump into the top list, and then it's going to be in a group. So here's a group right now. It's uploading it. Um, so it's not going to be completely done today, or completely done. But here we go. It just it just uploaded. You can see in the left hand side of the screen. Now it's completely uploaded. I'm gonna click on that. Um, also, then it's going to give it a second. It's going to need some time to load in. Um, especially because I just uploaded it. But then once it's uploaded in, you're gonna hit get best all deals and then it's gonna run a job. That job is gonna be seen here and you can run it here quickly and efficiently, right? So that's really what we're looking at in terms of the search list. This should save you all so much time and so much energy going down these products and you should be able to scrape hundreds of stores um, relatively fast. So that's just a bit. Um, if you have any comments, questions, or concerns, hit that like button if you wanna, if you wanna subscribe. We post these videos all the time. Um, and again, this is the easiest way to make a lot of money on Amazon. So click subscribe, hit that like button and comment if you have any comments.